All right, we're about to get it started here, and uh, and so it is um, Tuesday, Tuesday, and this is episode 118, man, 118 episodes um, so far in my podcast, and plenty more where that came from. Not even halfway through um, the year, as far as my podcast episodes are concerned, you know, I only started what I guess it would be. Uh, Four months ago, right? If I'm at exit, um, exit. <laughs> if I'm at um, episode 118, so uh, 120 would be about exactly four months. So um, I'm just about there, guys. So uh, let's get started, man. Let's get started because uh, I think today's podcast is pretty interesting. So and it's about one of the things that one of the false beliefs that I believe that people have when it comes to achieving the life that they want so here it goes what's up gang how you guys doing it is lieutenant sal blue 20 a year law enforcement veteran and the author of the top 25 mistakes in route to the good life that is right guys um a action packed page turner motivator right with some tons of good stuff in there to help you guys to achieve the life that you want. My little uh, biography in the back, just about me and my family. But um, anyway, guys, I uh, put that book out this year, April of this year, and um, it has done well. It has done well for me, and um, and I'm excited and motivated to teach a lot of the concepts that I'm talking about in my book and my daily podcast. But I actually have another book going to be coming out soon, right? You guys know that I put out my quick little book, my mentor manifesto, which was a byproduct of my top 25 mistakes. And so um, I got those two books out, but I have another book coming out, another edition of the top 25 mistakes. And um, I'm really, really, really going to be digging deep into this book. I initially wanted to launch this book. Um... Um, before the end of the year, <clears throat> so um, I am. I got my sights set on December first to get it out. So we'll see how that goes, guys. See how it works out. But um, definitely, guys, um, hop over, check out the book at my website, LieutenantSalBlue.com. I am giving it away free. You pay shipping, so that's nine ninety five, guys. And I got tons of bonus and extra that you guys can grab up over at the website. So hop on over to LieutenantSalBlue.com. Pick up your copy today, guys. Pick up your copy today. Uh, so let's get started in today's podcast, man. And today's podcast is something that I was listening to. Uh, and I'm always listening and paying attention, right, at work. I, I come across tons of people and they have all different types of conversation. But today's conversation was about motivation, right? Motivation. I had somebody, we were talking about uh, doing a workout, and I'm doing right now an uh, MBF challenge, Muscle Burns Fat on Beachbody Challenge. And I had somebody begin to talk about motivation, how um, they weren't motivated enough to uh, do this type of workout, to be participating in this challenge. And then the other person was talking about, I need challenges to motivate me. And then another person was like, I really don't know what motivates me in order to get into shape, you know, to get the body that I want, to have the health that I want. And so I, ne- I felt I needed to touch on this. I felt that this was a very, very important topic and a very, very huge false truth when it comes to people having the life that they want, when it comes to people achieving goals that they want, when it comes to people winning in life, right? Isn't that what we all want to do? We all want to win in life. And when you are relying on um, false truths, right? Um, Things that aren't proven facts to get what you want, you very rarely achieve the life that you want. You don't get it, guys. It doesn't happen for you. And I want you guys to understand this as I talk about it. So many people talk about motivation, right? And so my question to you is this. Do you believe that motivation is the key to your success? 
answer that question, write it down, and at the end of this podcast, tell me if your answer was dead on correct or whether it was wrong, whether you had the false belief. So um, I am going to get into motivation and what it does for you and what it does not do for you in today's podcast, guys. So uh, the first thing I want to talk about, right, is motivation is only the entry level to success. Success as people see it is not how it is displayed on social media on in t- television and movies and stuff like that success does not come as fast as people think it does right success is and it's not even a, that it's a destination right it's not a place where you get there and you say I'm a success this is it this is what success is I'm here no success is dynamic right it is always moving it is always happening right and there is never a moment where you are stuck solid not moving in a place of success and the reason why is because life doesn't stop moving life is always changing rapidly changing right so what success is guys is success is something that you look back on after you have had many many years of a consistent proven path of achievement right so whatever your goal is whatever you're trying to do you have to understand that success and the true definition of what you're going to get at success is linear it's, it's a long path uh, of, of positive achievements of things that you want to do in your life and success means different things to everybody so um, I am not going to say specifically what success means to you and the steps you need to take and I'm not going to say what success means to someone else and the s- steps they need to take all I can tell you is the steps that I have taken to cre- create success in many many aspects of my life right and the fact is is that that success did not come at a moment right that says came after me looking back and being satisfied with the path that I taken to get what I want out of life so I hope you guys understand um, where I'm coming from when I talk about the path that I've taken right you can only view success in the future looking back in the past so if you feel that where you're standing at right now you're successful then you're probably not looking back at your past achievements right you're thinking that this is it this is the moment and the moment you feel that you are in a place of success is the moment you start to lose is the moment that success slips away like a thief in the night guys it will leave you as quick as it came to you that is how success works man success doesn't just stay with you and that is who you are and that is what you're going to be for the rest of your life no success takes hard work it takes grit it takes dedication it takes commitment right it takes a lot of hurt feelings guys and probably even tons of enemies to boot that's what success takes right you know a lot of people have a definition of success and they they think that they can put it in a freaking harlequin romance novel or a um or a, a greeting card right success is euphoria success is fantastic success is love you know no <laughs> success is not those words and, and to be honest if you truly believe that success is those words when it comes to achievement then you're probably not working hard enough to achieve success yourself guys so um, 